What's up guys? I just wanted to quickly preface this video that this video actually was filmed back in March and somehow I lost the footage in on my computer. I didn't realize that I never finished this video and I recently found the things that I hauled in a little bag and remembered that I filmed this video. So I just wanted to pop in here and let you guys know that this was filmed a few months ago but I still wanted to release it and I honestly forget what I hauled now <laughs> that we're here a few months later. So Let's rewind back to March. What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. For those that are new here, hi, my name is Rochelle and I like to make thrifting and fashion videos along with a little bit of beauty and just sharing my life with you guys over here on my little corner of the internet. For today's video, I've noticed over like the last few months that a lot of you guys have been requesting me to have my dad back on my channel. I've had him featured on my channel several times to go thrifting and do fun things together. We have like a good banter, I feel like, and you guys always like to see, I don't know, us being our goofy selves together. So I told my dad that and he was like, hey, let's go thrifting together and have a nice like father-daughter day. So that's what I'm gonna do today. We are gonna go thrifting at my favorite place, uh, Deseret Industries that's about an hour and a half away. But while we're down there, I was thinking maybe I could try to talk him into stopping at like Trader Joe's or something like that. So instead of just being a pure thrifting day, we're just gonna have like a fun father-daughter day that includes thrifting and other things as well. That's what I have planned. We'll probably get some lunch and I'll just bring you guys along with us. It's a beautiful sunny day. I'll show you guys my outfit really quick because he's not quite here yet. For my top, I am just wearing this fun little like Zara. I actually think it's a Zara Childs shirt that I thrifted maybe like a year ago or so. On top, I have this really cute little longer duster cardigan that my mom actually ended up giving to me. She was getting rid of it. For my jeans, I'm just wearing my favorite H&M jeans. And then for my shoes, I'm just wearing these cute little like short uh, Zara cowboy booties. Look who it is! For those of you guys that know my dad, welcome, welcome back. For those of you guys that have never met my dad, because it's been a minute since we've thrifted together, this is my dad, Don. Uh, he likes thrifting too. <laughs> uh, he likes thrifting too, yeah. Um, I need to get some shorts and t-shirts for the warmer weather coming. Spring Maybe. stuff. Yeah, check out their like, shoes. Oh yeah, he's yeah. got one of his favorite pair of shoes came from this store, so. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> those little slipper shoes. Uh -huh, I saw things, someone yeah. recently with those shoes and I almost asked him where he got them so that if we need to repurchase, yeah. you could, but. Yeah, yeah. All I really right. like those shoes. And uh, any housewares? Uh, nah, I don't think so. There's so much stuff in here, you guys. I'm gonna try to be really selective because you guys know I've been thrifting a lot lately and have been trying to be better about getting too many things. So hopefully I don't find a million things today. <laughs> But this is my favorite thrift store, so, and I don't come here very often, so. Hopefully, I contain myself. All right, I came straight to the purses because it's kind of near the bathrooms. And last time I was here, I found so many cute purses. And I just found this one. This is actually kind of similar to one of the ones I picked up last time. I actually think it's kind of cute. <laughs> I don't know what's with me and like the sequins and beading lately, but I've been really feeling it. And I kind of like this one. You guys know I've been loving green. <laughs> it's kind of cute. I like that this one is pony hair, but I don't love the strap. I feel like that's always the problem with me. I don't like the straps of a lot of bags, but I actually kind of like the like zebra print pony hair. And I like that it's big. I don't know, I think those are fun. I also saw some cute little zebra print pillows over here in the corner, so I'm gonna check those out really fast, and I'm gonna come back and start at the front of the store and work my way around. I like the print, but I don't like that they're f like furry. I was hoping they would just be like a normal material, because that would match my outdoor stuff, but darn. Okay, let's start over in the shorts and make our way around. I also will say I've been looking for a good film camera. Both of these are $100, um, but I have been wanting to get a, a film camera again because I feel like that's been something that's been like fun to do is get film and like actually get it developed. 
I don't know if I want to spend a hundred dollars though. I love this little thing that holds like, how cute is that little jewelry box holder or knickknack holder? Love that. There's this belt buckle and it looks like it says Ev. Does it not? Ev? All right, guys, I just checked out some of the like tank tops and like warmer weather shirts, and then I found a pair of shorts. I'm gonna head over to the skirts and dresses because I've been loving skirts and dresses. Dad just found me over here in the skirts as I was looking around. Looks like he's found a few things. Let's see a quick update. I just, I'm just gonna try on these jeans. Got some jeans, black, huh? regular jeans. Yeah. T-shirt, that's a t-shirt. I wanna find something to bike in. Oh. Traffic, you know what I mean? Yeah, Which bright colors, neon. Both are good. Both? Both are good. Let me see the front. Yeah, either one. Both are good bike colors. I want traffic. Don't, don't hit me. Don't hit me colors. I want, yeah, exactly. That's exactly what I'm looking for. <laughs> this is super cute. It's like a knit crochet little like floral. I feel like this would be cute over a bikini. I honestly have a few things like this, so I'm not going to get it. But if I didn't, I'd be into that. I think it's super cute and like very relevant. I feel like this is a lot of the stuff I'm seeing in like Zara right now. So cute. I'm in the dressing room and I found some bottoms. I found these little black shorts, a little sporty skirt, a longer leather skirt or like suede, and then these H&M wide leg like khaki pants. There's a the little like sporty skirt. I don't love the length of it. I feel like it needs to be a little bit like shorter or else it would have been kind of cute. This is the little leather it's a BB skirt and I do like it. It's kind of like a soft suede material and I like these little button details down the front, but I've been looking for one that's more of like a full maxi. This one's kind of like a midi and I do like it, but it's just not quite right. I wish it was just a little bit longer. It's definitely a winter piece. I don't know. Here are the high-waisted H&M wide leg. I love that they're wide leg and high-waisted, but honestly, the material on these ones, I don't really like the material. They're not very soft. So, yeah. I mean, I feel like I could style them, but I only wanna get things that I'm obsessed with. That's what I'm really trying to work on. This is a little jumpsuit from American Eagle. I think it's super cute. I love the print, like red with the white flowers, but I feel like it's really wide right here and it doesn't accentuate my waist very much. It does have pockets. Maybe if I had a belt. I don't know. This little Zara top, not flattering. Here's a little flannel. It like kind of looks like it's like a distressed, a distressed bleach kind of style. I like that it's cropped, but it's just Fashion Nova and it doesn't feel very good quality. All right guys, I'm gonna check out. I'm getting a few little things. Tops, a dress, a bag strapless bra for summer. Oh, dad's got two bags. Yeah, I got a bunch of books. All right, we gotta take a thumbnail. Find a good, yeah. a good snap to do. Hold up one of the bags so they can see we've made a haul. <laughs> okay. We're hungry. It's like 3.20 and we haven't eaten any lunch, so we're gonna go get some lunch. Food time. Yeah. Taqueria Garibaldi. Taco. Del delish. 
Taqueria Delicioso. Here we are. Here we are. Here we are. We're feasting. Lunch time. Lunch time. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, look at that. Look at that. All right, guys. Uh, we. we Got done eating lunch dinner. Now we're going into TJ Maxx, which is over here, and then we're gonna go to Trader Joe's. I don't think I'm gonna film in TJ Maxx because I'm scared. They get mad. <laughs> they get mad at TJ Maxx if you Yeah, film? one time at Ross, I got fucking like, the employees like three way like came at me. Mean. Yeah, like I was gonna like argue them. It was weird. I was like, oh, oh I'm so sorry. Like, it's weird. <laughs> they they get ready weird. to tackle you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, like <laughs> yeah, like it was like an aggressive thing. They came at me three like, Whoa. at the same time. One, two, three. At They're the like, same show time. me your hands. Yeah, exactly. It was so weird. And, I, and then they were like, you can't film in here. And I was like, okay. Stop resisting. Yeah, I was Stop like, resisting. I literally was like, they were like, you can't film in here. And I was like, okay, that's fine. So yeah, I don't film in, uh, yeah places like this anymore so yeah i'll show you guys what i get at tj maxx if i get anything i just want to do a quick rounds and you know just like a quick run through and then we're gonna go to trader joe's which my dad have you ever been to trader joe's no of course oh well yeah i feel like you didn't know you act like i'm a living I'm a, under a rock country, living under a rock you're a them country well, people yeah trader joe's yeah i've been to lots of trader joe's he acted like he didn't know what was in there just got out of trader joe's dad was impressed yeah, it's been a long time since I've been in Trader Joe's. I forgot how cheap some of their stuff is for good stuff. Yeah, good good stuff, affordable prices for like, you know. Yeah, I got a know. bunch of stuff for my smoothies for cheaper than at Safeway for sure. He's been really getting into smoothies lately, guys, so yeah. I've actually been getting into smoothies lately too. Dad's signing off. I'm out. I got groceries to take home. He, wanted, the fridge and the he fridge. wanted to I say goodbye to all of I his internet friends. Yeah. All right, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed that little thrift with me with my dad and just like a nice little date day. I did end up finding everything that I hauled in this video right here. So first up, I found a cute little bikini top. I love little black bikini tops because I feel like they just go with so many of the black bottoms that I already own. So I got this one and it was just two bucks. I love Desiree, they have great prices. I did end up getting the zebra bag. Now this does have quite a lot of wear on it. Um, it's definitely not in perfect condition, but there was something about the pony hair and the zebra design that I just absolutely loved. So I was willing to get it despite its flaws. The arm handle right here does have quite a bit of like tarnishing on there. I don't love this strap either, but I think that I could honestly just remove this strap and attach my own straps, which I like to do very often because I don't like this size either. I don't know how much it was because the tag is gone. So hopefully I told you guys when I was looking at it. It's originally from Ann Taylor. And yeah, I really love pony hair. Moving right along. In the past, I've thought that I didn't look good in tube tops, but this year I've really been into them and I feel like I've been seeing them a lot more too. So this one's really cute. Does it look okay with blonde hair? I don't know if I look good in yellow anymore now that my hair is so light. And it was originally from the brand Good Luck Gem. I've never heard of that brand before. And the price was $1. $1, so cute. Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. How much did I spend? I spent $30. I tried this on for my dad and he said that it was really cute, which is why I ended up getting it. And it is just this little fashion Nova top right here, still new with tags. I do tend to like the one arm tops and then the no sleeve on the other. And then this cute little scrunchy thing on the side. I always really like these little like ruched tops this would be really cute with like a pair of white pants a pair of black pants all sorts of just regular jeans it's all wrinkly since it's been in the bag for a while but hopefully it looks better on the try on and then this one was the thing that i liked the most from the haul definitely it is a dress from the brand exhilaration which was just a target brand but i honestly feel like this dress looks more expensive or like more fancy than that and super fun so it is a tube top again and then the bottom is this beautiful, like, it looks like watercolor with a bunch of paint splatter, but almost like butterfly leaves, butterfly wings, and it has some flowers on it. It's just like a really interesting mixed media print, and I don't have anything in my closet like it. I really like those, like, funky splash, paint splash looking things. 
super cute for like a barbecue or a hot summer night date night. The front here has these fun little ties down the front and this one was six dollars which is pretty good that's about comparable to my goodwill's dresses they're like from six to nine dollars usually so um pretty on par with goodwill's pricing for the dresses but i really liked this one all right you guys that is everything that i ended up getting today i loved it i hope you guys had fun hanging out with me and my dad it's such a nice time when we spend quality time together and it's fun that he likes to go thrifting with me because he knows that that's what i like to do and sometimes he likes to go too he loves being on my channel so thanks for requesting him to come back on a few of you guys have said in the past like oh we want your dad to come back thrifting with you i'll see you guys soon bye love you Mwah.